Hi, my name is Ashok. Today we are going to see how to check the system maintenance in our tenant. Basically, when uh, we log into our system, sometimes we will be seeing such a kind of a screen where the system has gone for maintenance. We'll be wondering, uh, we have not given any intimation. The users might be wondering, might be the product owner, might have got an email triggered from SAP intimating that system will be having a downtime for so and so date or so and so time and etc which will be uh, intimated to the uh, product owner but uh, the end user or the partners or the uh, other person who is handling the system might not be aware of such things so to check those things you have to go to your uh, BYD system where you will be able to see in the work center service control service control center under which you will be able to see maintenance maintenance schedule once when you click on this you will be able to see a calendar kind of a screen here in the screen uh, you, you can like trigger it based on month you can filter it based on days week month and year through which you can identify Either your system is going to go for schedule on that particular month, week, or day, etc. So there are like few categories like uh, the identification of uh, the task is like it is today. It is in purple color. So maintenance it will be in green color. So so and so upgrade, emergency, and etc. So basically to know what what is going to happen on that particular day, you just have to click on that particular day. You'll be able to see the start and the end time and the duration of the maintenance so since it is in a green color this uh, on saturday august 3rd i'll be facing a maintenance for so and so hours so through this you will be able to identify whether your system is going to go for maintenance on that particular month so to avoid such uh, cases like say supposing a partner is going for an implementation on that particular month he can schedule this uh, planning of implementing the uh, SAP by design to the client based on this calendar. So this will be very helpful for the partners as well as for the users who are using it. So based on that, they can schedule their task accordingly and they can proceed with their transactions. So thank you for watching this video. Hope to see you in next video with some new updates.